All right, that's what I call a rude interruption from that last video. I had to stop and go, um, go figure out what was going on. But anyway, now here we are back to Zap. Um, so this this environment a bit overwhelming for him, and he's new to this environment. Um, the, his biggest issue is he doesn't like to be restrained. So that means, and restraint means, you know, you put your hands on him and you're going to pick him up to do something. Put him in the carrier, put him on the lap, get him off the counter, whatever it is. That type of thing makes him super, super nervous. Um, he's young cat, so I think that he's going to overgrow that and move away from that with consistency and knowing that he can trust his person. But obviously in the number of moves that he's had, um, which are quite a few for a two-year-old, you know, somewhere someone has been mean to him, and so he's very suspicious about what's going to happen. And, you know, gosh, who knows? I mean, the things that happen to these cats and they go through is just sometimes horrifying to even uh, hear about. So he just needs um, to go into a home, someone to work with him, um, and you're going to get a very loving, very nice, friendly cat, but you have to be... You can, I don't, I'm not going to say hands off, because hands on is fine. He likes to be pet, brushing, um, touching, all those things are good. He just doesn't like to be uh, held onto, like you have a purpose with holding him. That makes him nervous. So I think over time, um, I know over time, that will dissipate. But initially, and of course he's now in an environment where what's happening? Well, I'm trying to catch him to get him to the vet. I'm trying to pick him up to give him his worm medicine. I'm trying to, you know, do this, that, and the other thing. So it's not really helping, um, you know, what's happening here. So we need to get him into a home. He does have a vet visit coming up. Um, and that will be this week. And uh, But he's, you know, I don't expect any surprises at that. Um, and we'll see how he does and then he's ready to go.